Hi, it's me again with Corel Doll Tips and Tricks. And somebody left me a message on one of my videos. How do you select all the objects to change all the objects at one time? Well, there's a couple of ways. You can marquee them around there with your pick tool and you can left click blue. You can right click black, which is the outline. Or you can go to uh, uh, edit and select all objects. The text is an object. So we're going to change it to blue. If you just wanted to select the text, you go to text, select all text, and it'll just select the text. And you can always go control A. Control A is almost in any program to select all. There's probably a couple other ways, but that's the quickest way for me. If I want that top row to be red, I just select that top row. If I want them all to be red, I select all of them with the pick tool. I just draw an imaginary dotted line marquee box around there and you could select them all. Now you can't, there's a couple of macros where you can change the size. You can change the size by stretching them out, but you're not changing the individual. I mean, you're changing them equally. Like, let's just, let's do a little test here. Let's, uh, let's draw. Let's draw some squares and make them, uh, let's just make them five inches. And then let's control D and make a duplicate and let's, and then control D again. So I've got three five inch boxes. Okay. If you stretch them, you can make them all equally bigger, but you can also, if you wanted 10 inch boxes with your Ratio locked right here, you could go 200%, and now your boxes are 10 inch boxes. Anyway, I hope that answered this question. Thank you for watching.